week 17, day three. We've got legs and a run. Um, obviously, I did not go to the gym yesterday. Whoopsie daisy. Uh, mainly because I went and played 18 holes of golf after work, and that is um, workout enough. You know, I say workout enough. It's taper week, and so I'm not super pressed about getting to the gym. And also, after 18 holes of golf and you know a similar number of beers, you don't really feel like going to the gym. You know, especially even even if you have time. Like I got back and the gym was still open, and I thought about it, but I was like, ah, driving probably isn't a good idea right now. <laughs> so so we didn't go to the gym. <laughs> um, uh, shit. On, on another note, have y'all seen like the whole Roman Empire trend going around on TikTok right now? Because both my girlfriend and some of my friends back home both texted me about it and asked me if I think about the Roman Empire. And I was like, yeah, 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 for sure, I do. And I told her, I was like, yeah, yeah, like, you know, off and off, you know. Um, and like all the girls are like thinking that's crazy that... The Roman Empire, like, the guys think about the Roman Empire all the time. It doesn't surprise me one bit that every, just about every guy will think about the Roman Empire, you know, every week at least, a couple weeks, whatever. It doesn't surprise me one bit. I mean, think about it. You, you think about any kind of war? Dude, 300 Spartans, like, like the Romans were fucking proficient at war. It's That's an easy way in there. Watch the UFC. You think about the Colosseum and gladiators, you know? Um, anything government based I mean we, we took a lot of stuff from from the ancient Roman government and even like if you're thinking like about philosophy stuff you know there's Marcus Aurelius and his meditations book like there's so much and then I mean hell just think about that that part of Italy and Greece and like all like all that was owned by by the Romans so it's like if you ever think about going to travel there like my friend just went to Italy last week it's like okay like there's something to think about with Rome as well. I mean, there's so much shit to think about. It surprises me that girls don't think about Rome or the Roman Empire. And not only the Roman Empire, though, right? Like, ancient Greece. Like, you could get into a bunch of shit with them, too. I mean, that's, that's the birthplace of uh, democracy, isn't it? You know, the fucking... No, oh, what's it called? The religion? The ancient, like, Zeus, Poseidon, and hate, like... Dude, I could I could read books about that all fucking day. I mean, you saw me the other day. I was thinking about frogs for an entire workout. I mean, could you imagine how long I could think about the Roman Empire? Fuck me. Fuck me. There's so much. There's so much. And then you can get into, like, the Mongolians and shit like that, too. Or the Ottoman Empire. Oh, buddy. Now you're just opening a whole other can of worms. And now, since they asked me about it, now I find myself thinking about it way more than I was before. So they've just made the problem that much worse. I need to go buy another book about it. I, I need another book to read. A book about the Roman Empire would be good. I'm going through meditations right now. So lately I've been thinking about the Roman Empire quite a bit. But, you know, now that I'm seeing it all over TikTok and people are talking about it so much, now I'm getting curious about some more things, you know? Like, um, I think about Julius Caesar. The, Ro the Romans' enemies were at their gates. They'd appoint one man to protect the city, right? They would give one man all the power to protect the city, like all the military power and everything else. And he ended up not giving up his power, I think is what it was. And then they ended up, you know, his closest, his closest confidants ended up turning on him and killing him. But, um, yeah, I'd like to learn more about that because I feel like there's a bunch of holes in there that I really don't know. You know, like, how he was as a leader in general. Was he, like... Was he loved by the people or did everyone hate him? I don't even know. You know his name. You know Julius Caesar's name. Obviously, there's a salad named after him. Um, <laughs> I don't know if that's actually... There's another question I can have answered. I don't know if a salad's actually named after him or if it's a, just a coincidence. Maybe he loved Caesar salads. I don't know that either. There's so many questions. So many things to look up. So, um... Oh, shit, we're five minutes into this video now. All right, that's my little rant legs oh uh, yeah we're gonna squat and we're gonna hit leg extensions hamstring curls and a couple things in between and we'll fucking see but uh yeah 
Yeah, obviously I'm just leaving work right now, so I'm still on all my work shit. You can see my golf bag and everything back there as well. Yeah, that's all I got for you right now. We will catch you uh, in the gym for first set of squat. Final set here. Um, it sounds like this thing's breaking. If I break another one of these things, I'm going to be pissed. Um, I ended up starting out with leg press just because there wasn't a squat rack open, but I see one open right now, so I'm going to go ahead and finish up here and quickly go hop on that. Um, I'm honestly not mad about starting with leg press. Usually, I like to start with squat just because my legs are fresh, but um, I'm not going super heavy today anyways. Just, you know, I don't want to risk any kind of injury a week and a half before the Ironman. So, we're keeping it pretty light. Usually, I got four plates on. Today, we just got three. Um, just make sure I get a good stretch in the hamstrings. Then we're going to move on to squat from here. Let's go ahead and finish up. All right, second set here. Um, like I said, just going for sets of six, fairly light, just making sure form's good, taking it nice and slow. Nah, it's all you. But yeah, just 3.15 on the bar. Stay here for two more sets, then move on. Um, I don't usually like squatting in sweatpants, so I'm terrified I'm gonna rip them, but it is what it is today. I forgot, I think I forgot like all my shorts sitting at home and just like didn't throw them in my bag. So, which also probably means that I won't be going for a run today because I don't want to run in sweats. So I think instead I'll sit on the bike and get a good 45 minutes in on the bike before I head out. But, um, yeah, All right, let's go ahead and get this set done. All right, last set here. It's funny, I threw on my like gym playlist and a random song came on <laughs> and I went to look up the name of it. <laughs> the song was called Hit Kids, Not Jewels. <laughs> that's, that's so fucked up, man. Oh man, I had it on like that like smart shuffle or whatever where it would play like random songs they would think did things would like fit in with your playlist. And that was one of them. I was fucking cracking up, man. So funny. Oh, wow. All right, last set. I'm just stalling, talking about hitting kids, not jewels. I wonder if that'll, like, get the video canceled on TikTok or YouTube or something. I guess we'll see. <laughs> Hit kids, not jewels. Shit. All right, third and final set of the worst movement in the entire world, Bulgarian split squats. I figured I may as well do them while I'm going light today, just so I don't have to go pick up the fucking 80s again, because that almost killed me last time I did that. So, sticking with the 60s, I'll rub them out for eight. Let's get it.
All right, it's getting late. Final set here. We're hopping on the stationary bike for a little bit to finish it off. Damn, I am sweating my ass off right now. Sweatpants and like a thick shirt probably hasn't the move. Speaking of, have y'all been to Five Below? Because that place is fucking fire, dude. All these shirts, five bucks. Five bucks. I went and I bought like four of them. And now it's all I wear. It's, it's, <laughs> I'm Five Below. I'm their number one, like, biggest fan. It's kind of lame. Their shirts are fucking sick, though. They're not even that sick. They're just five bucks. You can't beat that. All right. All right. Oops. Fucking grab my mic. Yeah, like a 30 minute, basically just a cool down bike. Um, this is real nice just because we can kind of keep my legs warm on the bike without actually hitting it real hard. <laughs> and um, yeah, keep my legs warm on the bike without actually get busting out the bike and going for a big ride <clears throat> and basically just a cool down for half an hour and so what was it four movements at the end of the day we had leg press to squat to look to bulgarian split squats to uh leg extensions it's a solid four right there i feel like I also actually really liked starting out with leg press before going to squat. I might start doing that more often <clears throat> where I'll basically just sit at leg press for, you know, just two or three sets and warm up my legs a little bit more. Cause usually I've just been, been jumping straight into squat and just like doing the bar for a couple sets, doing the plate for a set, doing two plates for a set, and then getting into the heavy sets. Where's that? I think that leg press really helped stretch out the hamstrings, loosen me up a bunch, and I felt fucking great on squat today. I was almost disappointed that it's taper week because it was one of those days where I really felt like I could have gone heavy. So I think next leg day, I was going to do the exact same thing that I did today, which next leg day will be in two weeks at the earliest because I'm not in the gym next week. So but we'll just play it by ear. All right, I think that's all we got for today. I'm going to go ahead and stop the video and finish up my bike. Better today, and we'll be better tomorrow. Good shit, team.